guys, so I just took a quick trip to Goodwill this morning with my son. I just felt like getting out and roaming around and I really wanted a coffee. So they actually had some amazing artwork this time. I was kind of shocked. And of course there was amazing baskets. The basket section was pretty full and I saw a lot of really cool stuff. Nothing that was over the top, I had to have this, but sometimes that's just the way it is. I wasn't bummed about it. Everything seemed to be priced at $3.50 for the basket. So when I show you guys all of the pictures that I took, I'm only going to show you a price if it was something other than $3.50. I hope you guys enjoy this video of my little trip to Goodwill. And please don't forget to hit like and subscribe to my channel. You guys have been so supportive and everybody is so nice in the comments. So I just wanted to say like a really big thank you for that because I wasn't really sure what to expect when I started doing these videos and being really consistent with them. I'm just having fun with it. I'm a stay at home mom now after I worked as a kitchen designer for 12 years and it was really hard after being home so much during COVID with my daughter not being able to go to school and all the lockdowns that we had. And then I was on maternity leave for a year and a half. And now I'm just staying at home and taking care of my son. I really needed this to kind of keep me going and give me a bit of a purpose outside of motherhood. And I just really appreciate all the support. All right, so I grabbed my iced coffee and headed on over to the Goodwill and started right at the basket section. Like I said, there was a lot of really nice pieces, nothing that I absolutely had to have, but I did notice there were so many baskets that would have been great in basket walls.
the furniture section also had some really cool pieces today that I wanted to show you guys as well as a couple of lamps that I loved. Fun little fact, I actually had this identical lamp, but in white, in my room growing up. My mom gave it to me. It was from the 80s, and I believe she also had this exact forest green one as well. a ton of pottery and glassware and teapots and things like that today so hopefully you guys enjoy this little peek at that artwork section was just packed today I couldn't take pictures of everything there just really honestly wasn't enough time while my son was still happy in his stroller but I took a picture of all of my favorites to make sure that I could include them here for you
a little side to this video. I was actually at Tilly's last week for something quickly for my husband and I saw a bunch of cute things in the home decor section. So I took some pictures and I'm just gonna pop them into this video for you guys as a little extra. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing all of the beautiful things that I saw at Goodwill today. I can't wait to go on my next thrift trip because I have plans to go out to my favorite antique store called Memory Lane Antiques here in London, Ontario. It's so beautiful, a lot more antique and vintage than thrifty finds and cheap items. I just think it'll be really cool for you guys to get to see what's there. I've been there so many times over the years, but I haven't been as of late. Probably been a good year since I've been there. I'm gonna take you guys along with me for that. Again, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and the notification bell if you want updates on new videos. I'll see you soon.